The National Assembly has resumed from its annual recess to carry out its legislative function for the country. During plenary in the Red Chamber, the Senate President's communication on not less than 17 items covering elections, alteration of the Constitution, request for loans approval, among others, were read by the President of the Senate, Bukola Saraki. The Senate resumes after eight weeks of its annual recess to a backlog of correspondence from President Muhammad Buhari. The answer to Section 21-1 and 27-1 of the Debt Management Office established in the Secretary Act 2003, I hereby request for distinctive and specific resolution of the National Assembly to A, issue 2.786 billion in euro bonds and other securities in the international capital market. Soon after reading the correspondence from the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria by the Senate President Bukala Saraki, the leader of the Senate announced the loss suffered by the Nigerian legislature while on recess. Mr. President, very distinguished colleagues, our colleague died on Friday, the 28th of September 2018. We all know, or let me remind us, that it is the tradition and the practice of the Senate to suspend all legislative activities when such an incident occurs in the National Assembly. The Senate observed a minute silence and upheld the rule of the Senate in situations such as this. It is stayed in a very played a role. On this sad note, I hereby adjourn the Senate till Wednesday, 10th October 2018, 10 a.m. prompt. Many Nigerians have looked forward to a stormy session in the Senate following statements credited to the Senate leader, Ahmed Lawa. They may have to wait longer as the Senate, in its sitting Tuesday, looked at bills that the President would return to the Senate without his accent and advance reasons for his action. From a National Assembly, Osaitino Sadibame, Core TV News.